Hello, it's me, Adam Phillips, The Money Guy, and I've got a brand new top tip for you. This week's top tip is all about my favourite time of year. Mm. Chocolate. Easter, of course, is here, and we get a time we get to celebrate and eat tons and tons of chocolate. So, hang on, let me just sort out my mouth, give me a second. Ah, that's better. Right, okay, so Easter is here, and what I want you to do is try and get as much chocolate for as little money as possible. So the little trick of the trade for this one is seeing something which is in every single supermarket and has been there for ages and ages, but people don't tend to look at it. Underneath each product, or above each product that you're looking to buy, uh, you'll notice there's a little ticket, and in the ticket will say how much the product is, and underneath that will break it down into per 100 grams of serving. So for Easter eggs, what we're looking for is for you to try and look at the ticket price and see how much money you're spending, so you, you know how much you're buying for every 100 grams worth of chocolate. For example, if you're buying uh, an Easter egg and it costs you £2 and it says underneath that it's £1 for 100 grams of chocolate, that's a better deal than uh, the Easter egg next to it, which is also £2, but costing £1.50 for every 100 grams of chocolate. What it means is you're getting 50% more chocolate for less money. So it's important that you check how much money you're spending for every 100 grams that you're getting. The lower the price equals more chocolate for less money. For more top tips, tune into the itsthemoneyguy.com website, or of course check me out on Facebook, and uh, feel free to subscribe to this, and hopefully we can save tons of cash between us all.